Good morning, everybody, and happy Friday. Good morning, friends. It is around 7 a.m., and I thought I'd surprise Stephen a little bit this morning. So I am making him some scones. This is my favorite, favorite mix. It's by Sticky Fingers Bakery. It's hard to find. I usually end up finding it at a local like little store, like a boutique gift shop, um, but I've ordered it online before. Hold on, I have music playing. I have a music recommendation too. I'm currently listening to Ladylike by Ingrid Andress. Um, all right, now that that's turned off, like I said, this is my favorite, favorite scone mix, and all you add is water. That's it. Then my game changer for scones is the scone pan. I will leave it linked down below. All right, so I divided up the batter and pressed it into the scone pan, and now I'm going to bake it for about mm, 15 minutes, so just until they're golden brown. Alexa, set timer for 15 minutes. So the scones are done. They are absolutely perfect. Um, and that's what Steven and I will have for breakfast today. So I have a recommendation and it's slimy sand. It is like literally touching a cloud. I mean, I've been playing with it and it has like been the most amazing stress relief ever. I highly recommend it. <laughs> I've been like listening to music and just de-stressing with this. Slimy sand for your kids, for yourself. Oh my gosh, it's literally sticking your hand in a cloud. It's the most satisfying thing ever. All right, I'm not gonna lie to you because I'm gonna keep it real. I look and smell like a barn animal right now. <laughs> I have been non-stop working. It is 2.30 in the afternoon and I'm going to go get cleaned up, shower, and try to look like a human being. I am cleaned up and I am literally just walking around outside just to get some sun and some fresh air. Um, and I, I'm telling you all, I'm gonna say it again, I know I said it earlier, Ladylike, the album by Ingrid Andress is amazing. Give it a listen. It's so good. It's so good. Um, I'm loving it. So I'm just gonna stroll, get some sun, enjoy the outside. Also, the fig candle from Diptyque, so good. It is like a perfect springy scent. I'm so happy with it. Going to grab my work laptop. Steven just took Bubba's for a walk. It is about four o'clock, but I still have some work that needs to happen. So, that's about what's going on. Steven and I just wrapped up dinner. Mm -hmm. Steven had a fish fry for Friday. Mm -hmm. I had some shrimp. Bubby, what did you have? Fish fry. Did he have some? No, of course he did. So Bubby had a little bit of fish fry too. Mm -hmm. So, now we're just having some wine. Now we're just having some wine and winding down for the night, but it's just been a busy day. I have my fig candle still burning, and yeah, we're just, we're just chilling. It, Steven told me it's the, gonna be the last nice day for a while. For like a week, yes. He said it's gonna be cold and snowy the rest of the week. So, we're gonna make the most of the sunshine. Also, I had ordered a bunch of stuff a while ago, actually like almost two weeks ago, um, and it came, so maybe before everything got really bad, I had ordered some, you guys know I love the brand Aesop, so I ordered the um, Hydrating Body Balm, which is now super handy because my hands are so red from washing them. I got the Parsley Seed Cleansing Mask. This is a really great mask. I got the, Aesop um, Lip Balm. This is my go-to toner. It's the uh, Bitter Orange Astringent Toner. It's my absolute favorite. 
And then I had also ordered some Aveda Rosemary shampoo and then the White Company. This is my favorite hand soap, how timely that I ordered this. Um, the Lyman Bay um, White Company hand soap. So those things came today. I was excited. I actually, because it had been so long, I had forgotten that I had even ordered them. But he's now eating his actual dinner. Steven was on a Zoom call with his coworkers today and they recommended you watch what? Uh, Tiger King. <laughs> so we're gonna give it another try. I started watching the first episode a little bit. It was a little crazy. You weren't, I, was, yeah. I think you, it's the day you went into work. I like watched like 20 minutes of it. I was like, nope. So we're gonna try it again tonight for the nonsense and tomfoolery that we heard it is. Yeah, apparently it's crazy and um, unbelievable. What are three words you would use to encapsulate the week? Um, home, um, unusual, and uh, quarantine. Yeah. I want to know if you guys, in the comments below, write three words that encapsulate your week. I think mine would be busy. Grateful. Home. <laughs> Those would be my three. I want to hear all three of your words that you would use to like encapsulate your week with. Um, you have to say, I get almost a full day's work in at home. Yes, no, you do. I'm trying to find batteries for, I, for That's why I didn't get videos for two or three days. I can't even remember. It's just literally, Stephen can attest. Mm -hmm. I literally work from the time I get up till about the time I fall asleep at 7.30. Yeah, um, it's been so, so busy. What are you working on? Well, because I'm taking on my Zoom calls in the office, the cuckoo clock needs new batteries so that the uh, pendulum will swing and uh, I need to order them online. I guess I could go to the store, but it's uh... I'd rather you order them online. Yeah. I know there are a lot of mixed emotions about like, should you still purchase things online? Um, what about the safety of the delivery people? I actually talked to one um, this week and they said, by all means, please continue to because they don't want to be out of work and they don't want to not have a steady income. So they actually, ours, told me, no, please do, please keep ordering because it's one way to like really secure our job. I know there's a lot of mixed emotions about this, um, but the people who deliver for me really encouraged us to continue to do so because they wanna have steady work. They have been so safe and so kind and so amazing. So next week I'm thinking about something I can do for them. Um, so I might put some care packages together because they are so amazing and so warm. So stay tuned for that. All right, I'm gonna wrap up this vlog. I know it's not much, but it's what I got. Um, and then the weekend, we'll be able to get a little bit more footage only because I'm not as busy with work. So um, I love you all. Take care of yourselves. I can't wait to hear your three words. Take care of yourself, my friends. Take care of others. Be kind, kindness is free. Give it to everyone. Until next time, which will be tomorrow, I promise. Bye-bye.